have lunch outside, make afternoon plans. It's beautiful. Do anything outside. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm painting with a very broad brush here. But since June the 1st, Tim and I were talking, we, we calculate five heat waves. Mm -hmm. In other words, four or five days in this case where it was so intolerable you couldn't walk outside. It was bad. It, it was really bad. So I want you to think about that. We lost basically 25 days of the summer due to heat. I mean, if you wanted to go outside, fine. But, you know, discretion was a be much better form of valor when the heat index is 103, 104. So we lost 25 days since <laughs> June the 1st, and what, what's that going to be about? Uh, a little bit over 100 days, where well, you're going to get five days back in glorious fashion right now. Temperatures today are going to hang in the upper 70s. We'll peak out maybe at about 81, very gentle degrees. Look at the gentle breeze coming at us out of the north and west. Big air mass change. Take a look at the, the wide radar picture, and that's where you can see how far away this cold front is. And the low that drug it east is well up over the uh, New England states right now. Game, set, match, and done as we concluded the U.S. Open. And the announcers would have said high pressures blending in. And really the forecast is not any more difficult than that. Okay, so look, you're knowledgeable consumers. We, we never talk down to you. You see that high down to south. How many of you just went, uh oh, heat pump? Not necessarily the case this time. Actually, what that high is going to do, and this is a big one. The wind's going to be coming way around, almost out of the, uh, uh, the western Great Lakes states. It is going to block some energy out of the area, and we really just don't see any difficulties coming our way. As a matter of fact, other than this moisture up to our north and east, you've got to go all the way back to the Rocky Mountains to even find a drop of rain. We're going to be uh, in some beautiful late summer conditions. I just decided to have a little fun. I'm going to hit the button here in a second. I want you to keep your eye on the timestamp. I'm extending the future cast all the way out to Friday. And what don't you see? I mean, just, you know, we go through Tuesday. We go through Wednesday. We go through, here it comes, Thursday. And the beat goes on. We just continue. You don't see any rain, and you almost don't see any clouds at all, not even fair weather clouds. We're getting ready to go on a run of sun that really, indeed, is going to be spectacular. 74 in Coggiesville right now. Aberdeen and Bel Air at 78. 80 degrees Elkin. Too shy of 80 in Pasadena. Elgin City in the mid-70s, Savings, Columbia, 72 degrees, Westminster, Manchester, and 71 in Tawnytown. Your seven-day forecast coming up shortly. 59 your overnight low, by the way. 59. Take it away, Lynn.